Hey guys, welcome to another lunchtime review. Today I'm going to try this El Monterey breakfast bowl. This one is a sausage and cheddar grits. It's egg, sausage, grits. I love grits. Jalapenos and cheddar cheese, as long as they're not plain uh, grits. So that sounds like they got lots of stuff going on. Six ounces or 170 grams for the meal. It's microwavable, of course. We bought these at Kroger. It's only $2.79. Not too bad. It's a pretty small, it's pretty light though. Six ounces is not a whole lot of uh, weight going on. Um, it is, hopefully you can read that. Um, it's 290 calories for the entire bowl, and there's the other info. So, um, yeah, I was seeing if they had any other directions. They don't. It's just microwave. So we're going to place the bowl in the microwave, set 50% power um, from frozen, 1 minute and 35 seconds. Uh, remove tray from microwave oven, pull film back, and stir the grit side only with a spoon for more even heating. Place the bowl back into the microwave and then 100% power for one minute and 35 seconds. So half power for 135, stir the grits and then full power for one minute and 35. So I guess you're thawing it out. But it doesn't, what's funny is it doesn't have um, thawed directions. So it says frozen, but anyway, whatever. No pull tab, you just gotta open it. Because I would have thought it out if if, um, if that was the right kind of way. So there's your eggs and your um, sausage and your cheese, I guess, and your jalapenos. Oh, there's some cheese on the grit side, too. So I'm going to get this in the microwave, and I'll be back. All right, so here it is out of the microwave. I haven't touched it um, yet. But I can tell you what. It said stir the, the grits after the first um, minute and 35 on half hour. Um, they said stir them up like it was going to be like they were all runny and stuff. They're not. They're still frozen. And so I just kind of broke them up into pieces. Uh, that's what I did. Let me stir them up really good now. I can tell you the last time I ate one of these meals with a spoon, unless it was soup. Uh, pretty good texture. Um, a few of the edge pieces got a little dry, it seemed like, but I will just mix them in with uh, the other stuff. So, I am going to let this cool off for just a minute, and uh, yeah, we'll try it out. I'll be right back. Okay, it didn't give it much time to cool off, but I think grits and eggs in general cool off pretty quick. So um, I didn't want to wait around too long. So I'm going to take a bite of the grits. It looks like they have some cheese mixed in there. Might have some eggs in there too here and there, but that bite didn't, but it might. Um, I like the texture. The texture has that typical um, gritty texture, you know, with grits. Grits have a cornmeal kind of texture. Um, that's where your jalapenos are, at least that's part of jalapenos, because there's some spice in there. Yeah, I just said grits, jalapenos, and cheddar cheese. Um, I really like those grits. They're cooked well. Um, if you don't like that cornmeal kind of, um, I guess, pasty texture, you probably will hate these, but you wouldn't be eating grits. You wouldn't get a meal that says grits on it if you don't like grits, so there you go. Um, I kind of like that texture, but... I've eaten grits all my life, so. so let me try the eggs. The eggs are a little, a little tough. I mean, that, that particular piece of egg was really tough. I mean, it was like, it was like chewing on a, a like a, not a marble, but, but not hard. But um, it was very, very dense, very tough. Really overcooked. I like the sausage. The sausage has a really good sausage flavor. Um, yeah, there's a couple of eggs. The, the one bite I got was, was okay, but then this one, like that big piece of egg right there, it feels hard. That's very, very dry. And um, usually scrambled eggs aren't dry. I mean, literally dry and, and kind of firm. It almost feels like you're eating a piece of, um, of a meat instead of a, an egg. Um, I'm gonna mix it all together. Honestly, it's the big piece of eggs that are they're hard. The smaller pieces, the smaller pieces are still firm. They're not hard like the big ones are. I like that you don't get that many of the big pieces. I really like it. It really shines when you mix it all together, especially the eggs and the grits, because it adds this creaminess to the eggs. And then you get that overall jalapeno flavor. Uh, mixing them together, I like it the best way. Just mix it all together. Um, just know that the eggs, some of the bigger eggs are, are kind of hard. 
and the sausage while good it's not a super strong like it's not a spicy sausage but it does have a good sausage seasoning to it so overall i think this is a good meal i don't think it's quite um the greatest thing ever but i do like it i do like the grits i but again i like grits I, i'm gonna mix this all together and eat it all together um i'm gonna give this just a i'm gonna give it a three out of five i think the flavors of the grits are good um the eggs like i said the texture is just really firm and way overcooked um the sausage is good it has a good texture but it's just um it's just basic sausage so it's nothing special um yeah so all together i'm gonna give it a three out of five hope you enjoy this video thanks for watching